My name is Bill Miranda. I'm the Northeast representative for Cavity Sliders, manufacturer of pocket door hardware, sliding system, magnetic, ADA compliant products. And we're here today with Tom Blockman from Interior Management. And we're in this just spectacular project that Tom and his team have been working on with a gorgeous view of Central Park. And what we're talking about in particular is Cavity Sliders upscale product, our new AutoCAV system. Tom, what brought you? to find and search out the AutoCAD product? You know, uh, this was an interesting client where they've come up with a couple situations that, you know, required something a little bit more. Mm -hmm. So this is a situation where we had a passage from a kitchen to a dining room. So they said, can we make it automatic? Um, at the time, we didn't really know if there was a solution out there. Uh, so one of the vendors that we work for, the Grass Center, actually said that they believe that there's a system, but they never installed it mm -hmm. anymore. So I think that they made the initial contact. And how was it? operation as far as the installation went? Um, so I know that there's, uh, you can either just buy the header, the automatic header, or you can buy the whole framing system. This was a situation where we were dealing with existing walls. So what we did is that uh, it was actually pretty easy to adapt even the existing metal frame, mud stud framing. Um, put a pretty solid header up above, but mounted this thing in. Even without the door, mm -hmm. here we were able to adjust the settings on it. And then, um, you know, the door eventually came on set, and then it closed the way it should for the first time. Perfect. There was very little adjustment for it, and uh, no, I mean, I think that I have to give a lot of credit to our carpenters who worked on this. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, that no, was absolutely, it was a breeze to install. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Now, I know the AutoCAD has the capability to be tied into a home automation system. Is this also tied into home automation? Um, currently, what we're doing right now is that we've run wires to there with the idea that we can work with some type of uh, contact closure to have it opening and closing the door. It's not, um, as our AV system is not fully operational at this point, right. there is the idea that we would use, uh, that it would be integrated into the uh, home automation. Do you see cavity sliders and AutoCAD being able to problem solve going forward for you? Absolutely. Uh, but, I mean, anytime we've got a question, certainly we've never done this before. I mean, our carpenter's never done. Um, so I thought that anytime we had communications, they were responsive, helpful. Good. We were actually incredibly impressed with the lead time. Um, given that it's coming, uh, you know, with a lot of things with the hardware nowadays, you have an idea. This is an idea that got, I think, uh, brought up, researched, and then it was here on site within four to five weeks mm -hmm. from the initial cut. Kind of, so the time frame on this was very quick, and we were so I was able to not because uh, it came up mid construction. It wasn't the department wasn't designed for us, so we were able to accommodate it within the construction schedule. I think that once we have it integrated into the system, I think it's the type of thing where it really becomes, you know, almost futuristic. It's pretty cool to see it in action, and we really appreciate everyone's help. Oh, no, thank, thank you very much for having us. Uh, it was just a spectacular building. Thank you. Thanks, guys.